Hi guys, EBP Man here with Tablets for Me. And today we're going to do an unboxing review of the Defender Rugged Protection case for the LG V10. This case was brought to us by Otterbox. Now before doing the unboxing and actually the fit on our LG V10, I just wanted to highlight some of the features for those of you that may not be familiar with the Otterbox line. Uh, Otterbox creates one of the most durable cases on the market today, and they're re very much recognized for their drop protection, dust protection, scratch protection, uh, triple layer protection, as you can see here. Uh, it comes with um, screen protection as well, and a very durable belt clip holster. So this is really going to give you the best amount of uh, protection when it comes to your device. Keep in mind that the LG V10 is already a rugged phone. Combined with a case like this, you're going to have a phone that's going to last forever because you won't have to worry about any damage. So let's go ahead and check it out and see um, how it fits on the V10. So let's take a closer look at what makes this case such an excellent case for those of you who are looking for a super duper rugged case. You do have an outer shell and this has a built-in screen protector as you can see right there and it's made out of a hard plastic material. Uh, this combined with the back and you'll notice the back right here um, has another hard uh, plastic material and the inside it has kind of this rubbery feel to it as well as these patterns here that are going to protect you uh, in the event that there is some type of drop and shock so it's going to disperse the impact but there's kind of of a rubberized silicone here and it's pretty thick too. I want to see if you guys can see that uh, on some of the corners. So it has that nice additional layer inside protecting it. Uh, and that's um, also then both these pieces sit inside of this TPU type uh, material, this uh, rubberized material that's going to give you that third layer of protection. Uh, for those of you who may be working on a construction site or going on um, a hike or need um, a very durable holster, uh, this is one of the most durable holsters that you'll find on the market. You'll notice how thick the material is and it does rotate. Uh, and it does have a clip here so that uh, when you put it on your belt, if you do kneel down, you don't have to worry about it sliding off because it's going to catch on the bottom of your uh, belt. At the same time, this clip does serve as a stand. So if you put your phone in it and you want to watch a movie uh, or whatever you recorded, you can. So it's going to keep it up. So it is a dual purpose stand and it just pops out as easy as that. Very secure. Uh, you'll notice that this is where your phone is going to rest. And then you have this clip right here that is going to allow you you to kind of lock it into place and you can see uh, the material there uh, that it's pointing out how it clips in. So let's uh, put our V10 in and we'll see how everything aligns and then we'll take one more look at the case. So what we're going to do first is we're going to place the V10 in the back portion right here and then we're going to take the front uh, component and we're going to clip that on. Now there are a lot of little clips here that go into place and I just wanted to highlight those as we're putting that on. You notice how we have a clip here, a clip point here, and a clip point here. It also exists here, here, and here. So what you're going to do is you're just going to make sure you're going to press in in each one of those sides and then snap that in um, all the way around. Um, so once you've done that, you'll notice that everything is nice and sealed and everything is now uh, pretty good. Um, everything is feels like it's locked into place. Now the next thing you're going to do is you're going to take this um, rubberized cover and then that is going to encase everything. And you're going to work your way around bringing this piece um, into this channel here all the way around so that it has a nice fit. So let me go ahead and do that and then we'll take a look at the feel and fit of this case. So now let's go ahead and take a closer look at the case now that it's on the phone. Um, you have the built-in screen protector. You have some cutouts here for your front-facing camera, um, your earpiece, as well as the LED that you see there. Um, that's one of your sensors. You have no controls here, so you don't have to worry about that. The LG V10 doesn't have that. And there is nothing to worry about on either side. However, you do have um, a grip um, type uh, feature there. So you notice that there is a pattern there. We'll make sure that that's in focus for you guys. You can see that there's a pattern, and that pattern is going to help you um, hold on to that case so it doesn't slip out of your hand. Um, you have great bumper protection on each side and also screen protection as you can see here. It's pretty uh, deep right there so you don't have to worry about any impact to your screens. And on the back you do have rubberized material again with the OtterBox logo. You'll notice that the camera is very much recessed and you have no problems with it getting scratched, damaged, and anything of that sort. And also you'll notice that there's a matte finish all the way around the camera cutout as well as angled so which is going to help you with any kind of back flash. So when you take a picture the flash isn't going to bounce back and ruin your photo. You can still use your finger for fingerprint, the fingerprint sensor. That's not impaired at all and it also uh, 
have easy access to your volume rocker. On the very top, if we look at this right here, you'll notice that you have your pinhole mic and your LED. Uh, no problem there, so you can use it to change channels on televisions or whatever you're using that for uh, your remote on your phone. And then you have your speaker here uh, in your pinhole mic. If I were to open up any of these ports, there are two ports here that are protected. One is your headphone jack, and then the other, have off camera, uh, is your charging port. So both ports are easily accessible. Uh, so you have really nice protection all the way around when it comes to this case and also good grip. Let's check and see how it fits in the holster. So now here let's uh, is the holster. So from a holster perspective all you have to do is slide in your phone like this and you notice I'm going to put it uh, facing outwards and I snap it in. I'm doing it in this way because I want to use my stand for watching movies. So all I do is I just place it like this and I can watch it. Now let's say I'm not going to be watching movies. I'm going to press this up like this uh, and I'm going to remove it and I'm going to be working on a job site. I want to make sure that my screen is protected. Snap it in and now um, it's in a non-movie viewing mode and it gives me now the ability to keep it on my hip. Again, very secure holster. Um, I've never had an otter box uh, hip holster break like this part right here come off. Um, it's very secure. It has nice feedback when you switch it in each one of these angles so you actually feel it as it goes all the way around and once again you have that secure uh, edge here that's going to catch with your belt in the event that you do bend down and this comes up. So now let's take a second just to turn on the phone and uh, log into it. I'm sorry about that. Um, so you notice that my fingerprint sensor worked without any problems and I just wanted to show you how navigation is not impaired at all so I'm going from screen to screen without a problem and the other thing I just wanted to mention I do have a tempered glass screen protector on this uh, phone and that's on and it's not impacted whatsoever by the OtterBox case it's not lifting it's not impacted and you can see uh, based on the colors everything is nice and clear and uh, there are no problems um, even if I were to bring up a photo and I'll go ahead and bring up a photo for you guys to see here once I get into my albums uh, we'll choose something that we've um, shown in the past and let's go into my timeline for a second here is let's see uh, here's one photo that we had taken of just a figurine uh, when we were doing some videotapes and again very clear without any problem and if I were to let's get another one that I think is a little bit more colorful uh, we will bring this one in so uh, we'll put this in an angle see if it rotates there you go and you can see that I can still use the phone pretty much without any uh, feel of impact despite the fact that it has a screen protector on top of a screen protector. So once again, uh, ultimate protection uh, without sacrificing the utility or the usability of your phone. So this concludes our review of the OtterBox Defender Rugged Protection Case for the LG V10. We want to thank OtterBox for making this product available on our channel today for review. I also want to thank you for watching. If you do have any questions about the product, leave it in the comments area. And as always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.